So what's the secret to marketing anything online? Whatever you want to market. Uh, let's talk about it. I'm getting ready to go to a Seth MacFarlane, the guy who started, who uh, founder of, or the creator of Family Guy. He's doing a party with Charlie Theron at his house. So I usually don't wear a seersucker <laughs> shirt, but I wanted to record this real quick for my daily vlog because here's the deal. Whatever idea you ever have in life, number one obstacle will be marketing it because humans have a natural aversion to anything new. That's why brands like Coca-Cola keep winning because it's, if you come up with a soda, nobody naturally trusts it until it's been proven over and over. So marketing becomes the key to anything. No matter how great your idea, if you're an artist, musician, a social media person, entrepreneur, online entrepreneur, you got a pizza restaurant, you know, whatever it is, you have to acquire clients and keep them happy. And so, and here's the number one rule that everyone forgets. Don't market narcissistically. What I mean by that is don't market something that uh, only you're interested in. And I know that sounds so obvious. People are like, I already know that type, but not really. People don't really understand the extent to which I'm talking about. Uh, I'm gonna walk out here, it's a little cooler, a bit of light. People don't understand the extent to which our brain will naturally build our marketing uh, narcissistically, selfishly. So let's just take an example. I saw the other day this mattress commercial. You seen those ever late at night? Look how nice it is out today. They call this the magic hour because the light's real nice. Um, but this mattress commercial has the owner and he's not a very good, he's not very good on camera and he's there talking about why you should buy a mattress from him. And I was thinking, dude, nobody really wants to see you. <laughs> like, you know, you're not good at doing your commercial. Why don't you stay behind the scenes? And I know why, because he thought it would be cool for him to market himself in that way, but much better to make a persuasive marketing piece you know commercial you don't see the share you don't see the ceo of coca-cola in all the commercials now there is a time if you're good on camera you can use your own you know you can use your own images or your own videos but that was just an example that came to mind i was thinking who's this guy building the marketing for himself and at the end of the day if you build your market for yourself you're gonna be broke period so how do you get into the minds of people? That's what it really comes down to. And I'll tell you the simplest way to get in the minds of potential customers is to do rapid experimenting. Rapid, rapid, rapid. You know, I did, some of you have seen some of my YouTube videos that went viral and they've had, I just looked, check my stats in the last year, year and a half, did 540 million minutes watched. It's, it's a lot, YouTube told me. They won't tell me if it's the most, but it's a lot. Half a billion minutes, not just views, minutes. and. Um, part of that's paid advertising and part of that's virality. There's a formula. I'll talk about that in another video. But when I first made my very first video, I even won with a Lamborghini. It didn't. Not that many people liked it. It was me and Jeremy just driving around and it wasn't that persuasive of marketing. So, you know, maybe got 100,000 views versus the other one got over 100 million. And I was in Paris. Um, I shot that one first one that did not go viral and then I went to Paris for New Year's and then I came back and I was like, let me just keep experimenting, get inside the mind of people. But instead of me presupposing I knew what was inside the mind, I built some rapid tests. I recorded about 20, 30 more tests and one of them was the Here in My Garage video, which was kind of the beginning of a lot of the social media videos that I did. And that one's gotten, no one knows exactly how many people viewed it, maybe 100 million people globally, a lot. 50 to 100, probably more, but I'll be conservative with that. And that came from rapid experimentation. I experimented, that whole process was in two months. I did enough experimenting. So if you can experiment, then you won't build this selfish, narcissistic marketing that just doesn't work. Most time you watch TV, you'll see it all day long. And then you'll see those few commercials that really catch your attention. So whatever you're trying to market, get inside through rapid experimentation. Um, I was talking to, I got a guy, uh, a friend of mine, kind of a, we we're loosely affiliated, um, and it, his name's Adrian Morrison, and he built out a system, what he does, he goes on Facebook and he just like rapidly experiments products that people want to buy, he does Facebook advertising and different internet advertising, and he discovers through a process of trial and error, but rapid trial and error, what people want to buy, and he can build businesses extremely quickly. You know, e-commerce businesses, some of them make whatever, 
thousand bucks a month, ten thousand, fifty thousand. I don't know. The numbers are fairly big. Um, I mean, he's not making a hundred million bucks a year, but it's making seven figures, maybe eight. I'm not sure. I'll have to ask him his exact numbers. Doesn't matter. Makes a good living just selling all kinds of stuff that you wouldn't think that uh, necessarily would be able to make that much money, but he does. And uh, he actually wrote a book. I'm gonna put a link to his book. He, I got him to give a free uh, download of it. It's like how to build a profitable e-commerce business and it's this whole system of testing. A lot of you ask me for how-to stuff and this daily vlog is more just general advice. I don't have time to always lay it all out, especially because I gotta leave in a second, but um, I'll put a link. Now, he's gonna take this link down. I got him to put it up for, I'm not sure how many more days, but a few more days. I got him to give it away. You can get the ebook free, so you can read all the stuff. And he also has a link for a workshop you can watch. I told him I'd be an affiliate for it because he's done some stuff for me on Facebook marketing, because I do a lot more on other channels, but he really helped me with getting my Facebook marketing up. We work with him every week, just giving tips and advice. So he's helping me, I can tell you that. And so maybe it'll help you out. Uh, there'll be a link somewhere here, annotation or below. Click that link, um, get his free ebook, it's completely free, and then you can sign up for the free workshop. He has a paid version of it, but you don't have to do that if you don't want. You could just get the free stuff. And then for those of you really interested, I think he has a link to some paid, uh, more advanced program. But start with the free stuff, check it out, and just remember, whatever you're trying to do, you must be a marketing guru, a marketing master. You must understand persuasion. You must understand the mindset of your target market. And very few people can do this, but those who can get a huge reward. So wish you luck on what you're trying to do. Trust me, I've been in the marketing game. My first mentor, Joel Salton, was a direct marketer. I was 19 years old. I've been learning and learning you know, from mentors, all different type of mentors. That first mentor when I was 19, Joel Salton, and on and on and on and go, everybody I meet who knows a thing or two about marketing, I'm picking their brain, tell me, I'm showing up at their conferences, I'm looking at their online, you know, I, re you know, I read a book a day, I'm reading books, I'm, I'm, I'm investigating, I'm watching TV commercials, I'm watching, I'm clicking on internet banners, trying to re, uh, reverse engineer what the heck it is these guys are doing. And, and um, I look at celebrities, look at how Oprah marked herself, now Ellen, Ellen DeGeneres show, you know, DJ Khaled now, killing it on Snapchat, I watch movies, I don't know if you saw, I was in a movie, yesterday pop star that big movie andy sandberg came out it's funny as hell if you watch my snapchat i posted it but i watched how they marketed that thing judd apatow is a genius he did train wreck so make yourself a follower and a, and a seeker of every marketing technique and tip that you could ever come up with marketing is not cheesy marketing is a way of persuading people if you're selling something good to do what's in their best interest i'm so happy thankful that there's good marketing out there especially for good stuff you know, like this Rolls Royce I just got. This brand's a custom one, had 11 miles, just came off the boat, the Ghost Series 2. It's on my Snapchat and stuff. Um, I wasn't gonna get a Rolls Royce. You know, I was gonna get a McLaren, and then I was at the dealership, and they were telling me about this Rolls Royce, and they were so persuasive on how well it drives and all that, and that I was like, hmm, maybe I need to look into this. That's marketing, and I'm glad they did, because it's a badass car, it's better than a McLaren in terms of quality of ride and stuff like that little different apples to oranges but everything i'm glad you know joel salatin marketed to me to go and work on his farm i'm glad he was persuasive i'm glad different mentors at different times persuaded me to take a different path than than i would have gone on naturally so click the link download his ebook learn how to use the internet is powerful look i'm here on the internet connecting with you i, I looked i'm 103 countries i'm connected to people uh, following my stuff and, and that's all e-commerce that's the power of e-commerce so learn how to do it for yourself even if you don't want to be a huge entrepreneur you know you could use it for art you could use it for reading book I mean you could use it for art you could use it for your music you could use it like I said stores you can use it even as an employee of somewhere else the better you can market yourself the more promotions you could get so download it check out his but make sure you, you go into his free workshop too uh, I told him I'd be an affiliate because I like his stuff um, and then he's got a paid program that I partnered up with him. So, you know, um, if you decide, and he shows you, even if you don't know what to do in business, he shows you how to figure it out, how to source and, and decide what products will sell easily that aren't that hard to market. 
and uh, so it's kind of a you know step-by-step -step approach click the link let me know what you think leave a comment below after you check out his ebook and workshop what you thought of it okay talk to you soon